What's going on everybody? It's Mr. 560 here, 560 Gaming TV with a quick stream. Coming up still, I'm at Starbucks right now. I wanted to stream yesterday, but I didn't have any like noise or something like that around, but I wasn't able to, or at least I just didn't get around to doing it. So I don't know, you know. Um, so if anybody decides to come into the, to the chat and watch the stream, right? Appreciate you there. Um, try to keep the audio for the music down a little bit. Uh, I'm in a Starbucks right now, so it's a lot of, there's some chatter, not a lot, there's not that many people here. There's some chatter right now, but the music is pretty loud, which is par for the course when it comes to a Starbucks. But anyway, um, playing uh, Metal Slug Awakening, brand new game. Unfortunately, it doesn't have, um, <clears throat> unfortunately, Metal Slug Awakening does not have, does not support um, trolls. Doesn't have controller support. I don't understand that. Don't make no sense to me how they can ship such a great game without controller support. Uh, and I've heard that they've had controller support on other games before, so I haven't really played much of the Metal Slug series until now. This is the most I've ever played any Metal Slug series, but it's it's got a whole new format um, with the games as a service kind of stuff. So you know, we'll see how this goes. Um, I have the chat room. The chat is on this on the screen that's monitoring right now, but I move the game screen over to the other monitor. I have two monitors set up. And the problem is with the chat screen, um, I can't move that over. I was going to move it over so I could have something I could see, you know what I mean? But it just it won't let me do it. I don't know. OBS has an integration thing with Twitch, and the chat screen comes up. It won't let me resize it. It won't let me move it around. I don't know. It used to when I first. When I first did it, so maybe they updated it, changed it, I don't know. Maybe I need to update OBS, I don't know. I hope you guys can hear me good. Last time I was on here, um, people couldn't hear me much at all. So, we're going to try to, uh, this is going to be a quick session. This is not going to be that long. Mainly because I got things to do, places to go, stuff like that. So, I'm um, just sort of kind of like a test now. When I turn this on, Windows is so weird about its inputs and outputs when it comes to uh, devices. That I, the last time I had this hooked up the way it is now, it was fine. Well, at least it took me a little, you know, working around to get it to to get it there. And now it's like, no, it's not fine. I don't understand it. I have no idea. Uh, why am I signed in? I have no idea. What is going on with that? I have no idea why I'm not signed into this. Let's get it going. Don't be afraid to show some love in the chat. I'm going to turn this, I'm going to mute this mic in a second. But uh, don't be afraid to uh, show some love in the chat if you come through. Follow the channel, things like that. Every video that I record, every live stream that I do, gets automatically uh, transported over to my YouTube channel. Well, not automatically, I got to go and do it myself. But if not today, within tomorrow or the next day, I'll make sure just to uh, send that over. Most times I don't I don't stream this way with me in a video, but I've been trying to get back into streaming uh, with my camera on and using like overlays and stuff so that you guys can get a better better look. You know what I mean? It's all about the look, baby, the look. So uh, we're just gonna keep it moving with this, and I'm gonna shoot. I'm gonna shut this mic down now. Don't be afraid to come in the chat. I'll do my best to answer you in a moment. There, I believe there is a delay, so if I don't answer you right away, then that's probably why. All right. Now, I was on this earlier, <clears throat> this morning, um, this morning yesterday, I think it was this morning, I was on this earlier this morning, after I got up, I was just trying to like go through the motions to see what was going on, I think it was this morning, if not, it was uh, late last night, and I, and I could have streamed, but I didn't, uh, so you know, I'm trying to do my best to stay, uh, stay focused, doing what I gotta do, but you see there's a lot of events and stuff going on here, uh, I'm still trying to get through the story mode. Sometimes with games like this, you start playing and you forget about the story, man, because it gives you so much other stuff, other stuff to do. And, you know, it's good to always get through the story mode because you get certain benefits and perks and things like that uh, until they decide to um, 
until they decide to add on more, you know, to the story or anything like that, or give you more content. Finish this. Uh, I'm here, but the thing is, um, this these last two bosses have been, this last boss has been very hard to defeat. So I keep losing. So I need to kind of build up the characters that I have. Um, looks like I can do some upgrades right now. So sometimes it's better. It's best that I just do the upgrades and try to get the characters as strong as possible. But man, there's a lot of upgrading. So it takes it takes time. But as you can see, I'm level 36. Um, if you look up here, uh, my guns are at level 36. Uh, I try to keep all the characters. You know. I try to keep all the characters that I have active at the same power levels or somewhere near that. It looks like um, the main character, Marco, he's still the strongest. It's, it's, I don't care, whatever. Um, you know, I'm trying to build up different parts of their weapons and their, you know, their gear and stuff like that. It takes it takes time. It takes time. Uh, but not a lot of time. It hasn't taken me a lot of time. I just started this game, what, a week and a half ago? Maybe a week ago? So it hasn't really taken me much time to get to where I'm at right now. It is a fun game. It is fun to play. Good time waster, even if it's short spurts. You know what I mean? And you can probably, you know, you can, and you can actually play it for hours upon hours if necessary. You know what I mean? So, uh, you know, if you get the game, good. I heard it's available on both Android and iOS and on PC. Um, so, you know. Let's go, I'm gonna mute this mic now. Now I will admit there's a lot of stuff that they have you do in this game that they have. It's a lot of building going on. It's like they went down to like the microcosm of building the character. It, it could be, I don't understand some of the stuff. It's not like they have like a, at least I haven't found some sort of a glossary or index that basically explains what each part does or what each thing does or why. You know what I mean? Like it, they don't really actually explain all that. They just, they just kind of let you just go and just kind of, over time you start figuring things out. It's got more of an RP, uh, action RPG-ish feel now when it comes to building the characters. As you can see, that's rare, legendary, epic, common, uncommon, you know, gear, stuff like that. Um, basically, a lot of the games as a service 
type games along this line are like that. You know, it gives you a chance to get a level up type of gear and set the other. And I got some really pretty dope uh, guns and stuff. I'm still not up there, so I don't know. I'm an early adopter. You never know. I might, get, I might get some good stuff. But I do know that as far as currency concerns, if I go to the shop, at the top here, the top right, you got this is the only currency that they make you pay for. I'm not going to do it. No, 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 no. This is the only currency that they make you pay for. Everything else you can get for free. So there's a lot of different versions and forms of currency. That's the only thing, one of the things I really can't stand about these games and the service is that they give you, they build an economy around these games and they just continue to build, they just continue to create these economies around these games. And then it's so many different forms of currency. It's like, it's like, oh, well, how does this equal out? How does this pan out? Da, da, da. But when it comes to, you know, uh, pay as you weigh or pay for play, this is the only way you're going to get it. Everything else is pretty much free. You can buy and purchase other stuff too. As you can see, uh, on the $4.99 um, tier thing, it tells you the, the first top up gives you 310 of the blue gems. I get the blue gems all the time, so. We're going to keep it moving. Essentially, I'm not ready to purchase or make a purchase of money, use money to purchase things. In a game like this, I don't just, I don't care how much they throw this stuff at me. I don't care. I got to play the game first and get into it and see if I'm going to spend and waste time on this game. So far, so good. But, yeah, I'm not purchasing anything just yet. I don't have a problem paying for the game or paying for the things in the game. I'm just not going to do it right now. Okay, I'm only going to play this for about a good uh, 10 more minutes or so, just kind of like testing this and, and, and I'll be back on it for another stream, but right now I'm only going to play for about another 10 minutes or so and then I got to get ready to go and then uh, make some moves, you know what I mean?
Now, I haven't been upgrading all of my guns, but I decided to give this one, because I was using this one first with Marco, and it's really good. It's a good gun, so I decided to upgrade that one. I took it off of Marco, took all this stuff off of it. They automatically let you transfer the stuff over, which is cool. It hit station, you have a do-it-yourself for that, and they don't lock it into one person. You can actually switch the guns between every character. But this gun, I, I it was really good, so I decided to just kind of upgrade it. These purple guns and the orange guns, they're great. They're not, they're not office. Marco the Ace Pilot, requested clearance for tank. <laughs> We've got another dude on the squad. I'm starting to think that uh, there was only going to be one guy in the whole game. What I'll probably do is just have it. I wish you could have like an A team and a B team so that you can kind of play with one or the other. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. But I'm not putting him on the squad just yet so I can build him up. Okay, we're gonna run through some of these missions before I uh, turn this off. See how see how far we can get.
teammates cooperate to inflict more debuffs. It's bullet time! And I get do a whole mission without getting hit in this game. That's not something that's ever gonna happen in this game. Ever. Ever. <laughs> looking for the gems she said that evil is like grass on a plain it can't be uprooted by a harsh winter it goes away but begins again in an endless cycle i should have known why do you never tell me anything about her elia Uh oh, hold on. Technical difficulties. Okay, there you go. That should be it. I'm, I'm not really interested in the story. I'm gonna skip that. Plus, this, plus I'm, about to, I'm, I'm getting ready to turn this off. So, we'll do a couple of digs and then turn it off.
Okay, folks, that's going to do it for me. I'm going to come back. This was a quick stream. I just want to make sure this thing goes through right and I can watch it and see it and I can hear myself, this, that, and the other. Uh, so I'll be back. Uh, not tonight, probably tomorrow. You know what I mean? We'll see. But it's been swell. This is Mr. 560 here, 560 Gaming TV. Please don't hesitate to uh, check me out on my YouTube channel. Same thing, 560 Gaming TV. You'll see the replays for these come up there. With all that other good stuff, with some clips and whatever. You know, like, share, subscribe, all of this stuff. Peace.